No joke, on April 1st, you'll be able to sample wines from 24 big time wineries and vineyards. And meet the people behind them. A great chance to learn more about wine and host a wonderful local youth mentoring program. Yeah, fantastic program. Dennis Hine is with Vin Nebraska and from Partnership for Kids, Cheryl Murray. Hi, Thanks for stopping Cheryl. In. Good to see you. Good, Good morning. morning. Good to see you too. Good to uh, see you. Vin Nebraska. Uh, Dennis, let's start with you. How did this all get started? You know, we've been in existence now for over 25 years, and to put it in the simplest form, it's just a group of wine enthusiasts that got together and said, how can we use our love for wine mm -hmm. to raise money for charity? Yeah. So and we're a small group, 10 or 12 people, and work with charities. It's, I think it's a great example of how a small group can make a big difference, and you've been doing that over the years with different organizations, Partnership for Kids, and we'll talk to you a little yeah. bit in detail, mm -hmm. Cheryl, so our viewers know what you're about. But Dennis, what's happening at this year's event? Well, at this year's event, I brought uh, just kind of a representative sample mm -hmm. of some of the wines that will be there, uh -huh. Smith Madrone, Flora Springs, Silver Oak, Tume, Rombauer. Mm. Uh, Quaddy this year. Yeah. If you like sweet wines, Quaddy is the honorary winery of, of the year. I've never heard of that one before. But I do like a Moscato. Well, I would so like that one. one. You would you like, would like this that. One. Mm -hmm. And Ron Bauer, that's a, that's a favorite well. the, the, the Martin House. The <laughs> yeah. The Martin yeah. House. Well, Chardonnay. Is that what we're having today, Dennis? We're, we're going to taste the Chardonnay okay. whenever you're so ready. So you've got that over there. You've got the, the, the pump pump. What, what is that thing? It's called the Coravent. And what it does, it forces argon into the bottle, puts the wine back out so that you can keep the bottle in, in your refrigerator almost indefinitely. Mm -hmm. there, there's essentially a little needle that pierces a needle that through, goes the down cork. through the cork. Hold the glass up and we'll hit here, a quick well, shot so here. That our, our yep. viewers, here. I'm going to lift it you up just, a little bit higher yep. so our viewers can okay. see it over the just bottles. Just push okay. this down once and it forces the wine out. Uh -huh. It prevents the waste. Yeah. It prevents so there's the wine no from waste. going bad after you open it. Yeah. Thank you, Love Dennis. It. Here, Mike, I'll even give this glass to you. Really? I'm a good friend like that. Is that, that. the Ron Bauer? You, you keep... So you keep pouring, Dennis. Yeah. Oh, stop. I'll give this you to you. She wanted a bigger glass. That's why she gave me this one. We'll give her two dice. Oh, so. my, my husband is at home right now, jealous as all get out, because this is, for him, it's Ron Bauer. But I think, Dennis, to know that Ron Bauer, Silver Oak, that we're talking about some of the, these brands, the most respected <coughs> brands in wine, are at this event. But you've got the people behind those wineries and those vineyards to answer questions. Because when you first start out with wine, you're looking at labels at the grocery store and your head spins. And it's like, I have no idea what I want. Is it worth spending a few extra bucks on a bottle? Am I even going to notice it? What kinds of questions would you love to see people ask Dennis at the event? We want to start out with, what do you like? Mm -hmm. the wine is as complex as you want to make it but it all comes down to it's as simple as if it tastes good, drink it. Mm -hmm. What we encourage people to do is taste a lot of different things. You know, some people say they don't like Chardonnay. Well, you don't like the clean citrusy or you don't like the big buttery and they say, well, I don't like Chardonnay. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you're gonna have a lot of different Chardonnays to taste that night. Mm -hmm. Clear on into reserve cabs, uh, dessert wines. Like we talked mm. about, uh, oh, th so this is a fundraiser clean. for a partnership it. for kids. Cheryl, are you allowed to have a sip of Chardonnay? Oh, most certainly. Okay. <laughs> We got glasses here and mud as well <laughs> to partnership for kids. Thank you, yes. indeed. And Vin Nebraska. Thank you both for being here. And so yes. as we talk about this, it's a fundraiser for partnership for kids, it correct? Is. So yes. can you tell us, who do you serve? We're serving 5,400 children in Omaha public schools. And so most of our kids are in Eastern Omaha. Mm -hmm. They're in schools where the free and reduced lunch rate is about 90%. So we are doing a mentoring program and what makes us different and what makes it really extraordinary is that our mentoring and our uh, programming and our curriculum start at pre-K mm -hmm. all the way through college wow. into mm -hmm. careers. Yeah, so, you don't end with high school. No, That's we don't. And we're really yeah. setting the, the framework for kids saying, you know, in second grade and in fourth grade, you know what, mm -hmm. you're going to graduate from high school. After high school, there's college. Mm -hmm. After college, there's a career. We're laying that, um, that groundwork for them. And even in fourth grade, they start college tours. Mm -hmm. So wow. if they've gone all the way through the program, they've toured 12 college campuses by the time they graduate from high school. Wow. So they now have this idea of what mm -hmm. it means to go to college, mm -hmm. to walk around on a campus, to see a dorm room, to I, eat in a cafeteria. Yeah. These, I just went on a tour with kids to Wayne State College, my hometown, and one young boy, ninth grader, said, I've never been out of Omaha. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. You know, and so he wanted to run around the track, and I'm like, Aww. heck yeah, we've got <laughs> time for you to yeah. run around the track. <laughs> you know. And you've been doing this for 27 years. The organization yeah. has. What type yes. of difference do you think you've made? Mm. It's very significant because we're able to follow our mentees. We also work with over 400 mentors mm -hmm. that stay with these kiddos as they age, and we work in groups. So when that mentor might get transferred out of state or something, mm -hmm. we still have that mentee group when we bring in a new mentor. So kind of that. Um, that alliance, mm -hmm. that they're coming from the same place, they all have the same goal of academic excellence, graduating and, and moving into a life that is going to be different from the past generation. Yes what it's about. Yeah, absolutely. And today's um, an important day for if you want to go to this event to yeah. help raise yeah. money for you guys. Well, yes. p4k.org, that's the website. Mm -hmm. If you're, you want to go to the event, but then you also want to get involved with the organization beyond it, yes. please go to their website. But if you want to save money, as Mike was alluding to, tickets, today. the price goes up tomorrow, Dennis. So tomorrow. in the meantime, you can save 10 bucks by getting your tickets today. Call 402-557-6381 or log on to the website on the screen. We'll link you back to that from our site as well. But it's happening on April Fool's Day, April 1st yeah. at Hotel RL, and that is near 72nd and Grover from 5 to 9 o'clock that night. Thanks for bringing in the wine. Dennis, great yeah. to see you. Thank you, Dennis. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I know. Yeah. One Cheers. more. Thanks Thank you, guys. Yes. I know I didn't look at you. Isn't that bad luck to not look the person That's in the enough. eyes that you're toasting? Uh -oh. I That's heard enough. that once. Is it? Is it yes, bad? Yes, I just uh, felt like I was missing a moment there. Okay, it's okay. okay. We'll get through this together. Uh, square dance.